Did you know that oven cleaner can clean things other than just ovens? This is Renee Romeo and I'm going to show you how to clean your stove top with oven cleaner. So I have Easy Off Fume Free Oven Cleaner and I'm going to go ahead and spray it on top of the stove top. Now I have some buildup around each one of these gas outlets. You can use this on an electric stove as well, no problem. And then I also have the grates off and the grates, you know, they kind of build up with a little bit of debris uh, after cooking and it's kind of really hard to clean it with just regular all-purpose cleaner. So I'm just going to go ahead and shake this and I'm going to go ahead and spray it around each and every outlet here just to make sure that I get this really well coated. So here's the grease buildup and I'm just going to go ahead and spray this right on. Get it on there really well. And I've returned the grates back to the stove top so that I can get these really well too. So everything is getting sprayed with the oven cleaner. Make sure you get into all the nooks and crannies. Now once you're finished, here's the tip. You really have to take some plastic wrap and cover the whole thing. Now especially like me, if you have cats in the house, uh, sometimes they get curious about different smells and I really don't want them to get up here by mistake and get their paws full of oven cleaner. So this is getting covered for the evening and tomorrow I'll come back and visit it and I'll clean everything off. If you don't have pets, it really is necessary to cover this in plastic wrap because even though the can says fume free, there is an odor to it. It's pleasant, but there's still an odor. And if you wanna keep this odor away from the rest of your home, you really do need to cover it and get this thing to kind of keep in one specific area uh, so that it doesn't infiltrate the rest of the house. And so hopefully you can see here just what this looks like before. Uh, it's got a lot of buildup, especially along the sides. Um, you can kind of see that, how bad it is. So I'll show you what it looks like when it's all clean. So you'll see these areas here that have turned a little orangey. I'm just going to take my rag and show you how easily this comes up just like brand new, but you don't even have to work that hard. These are going to be placed in the dishwasher and I'll have the dishwasher do all the hard work. The grates are in the dishwasher set on heavy, but in the meantime, I wanted to show you how this cleans up. So we had areas here and I'll go ahead and pull this little top off so you can kind of see the grime underneath. And the oven cleaner works especially well over any enamel surface. Um, but you can see it with just with a rag is qu not quite enough to get all of it off. So let's go ahead and grab a stiff brush and just get the stiff brush in there and get that moving some of this grime out of the way. And that works so well. And then my secret weapon here is stainless steel polish. Now I'm using this right over the enamel and it's just going to polish this up really well and make it look brand new. Just like that. The last grate is in place I didn't have to lift a finger other than taking the grates off, placing them in the dishwasher, and then returning them to the stovetop. So your job of keeping your stovetop clean, it can be just as easy. Really, it's just letting the chemical do the work and having your dishwasher do the work for you. So is it 100% clean? No, it's about 95% clean. And honestly, I'm probably the only one that can tell exactly where all of the little grease spots still are. So if I did it maybe one more time, I might get to the bottom of it, but then again, I might not. And 95% is good enough for me. So this is Renee Romeo. Thank you so much for watching this Pearl of Wisdom. And I hope that I make your life a little easier by bringing you these great tips.